Divine Design by Lawson W. Murray When God started making the earth and all we see, darkness cloaked the violent seas, hiding his activity. Then God said with intent, Let there be light. Suddenly it was glowing and everything was bright. Again God spoke to separate the waters to make the sky mix with every shade of blue. It certainly wasn't dry. Next God ordered the land to rise up and appear. Solid brown and grainy, this crust, the lithosphere. Green up, God said, planting vegetation everywhere. Wholesome fruits and crunchy grains, a scrumptious affair. Then came two lights in the sky to distinguish day and night. A soft moon graced the evening, a bright sun for the light. Our world was now ready for the creatures in the seas, and birds in all their finery were made before the bees. Big and small, God made them all. Life of every kind. Chameleons and caribou, designed in the Maker's mind. But the best God kept until the end, the apple of His eye. In His likeness, one of each. A gorgeous girl, a handsome guy. And giving them his blessing, God said, Go fill the earth, prosper, take control, be productive, give birth. For I've given you sweet corn, yummy wheat and oats to eat. Just taste and see the pantries filled with every kind of treat. Yes, everything was very good. Absolutely awesome, God decreed. Creation completed perfectly. His work fully guaranteed. So now the question simply, is there something we should do? Because God made the whole shebang, including me and you.